What is going on everybody? This is gonna be the third dev vlog and ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Oh my gosh, I am so freaking speechless right now we literally got a hundred subscribers in before 2024 and also guys i just want to say happy new year to all of you guys you feel what i'm saying so and also i just want to say guys i appreciate all the comments i read i tried reading all the comments if i didn't read yours i am sincerely sorry but this is what the game is right now this is the winner section this is the stage and Ladies and gentlemen, this is horrible. Like, the, literally, the obvious is so bad and all that stuff. You know, like, I mean, there's some good ideas and stuff, but it just doesn't stand out. Like, it's just not good, you know? It's like, you just spam walk on here and then... You have to like spam walk on this to that. So we're gonna fix that today. We're gonna like delete all of this and make some better maps. I I'm not sure if I'm gonna post a picture of what the map could look like, but you know, it's, it's all good. You feel what I'm saying? This is what it looks like right now. And also guys, let me show you guys something. Alright, so I'm in the base plate and it looks like nothing, but there's something right here. There's a GOI button right here. And if you guys saw my community post, you probably know what is going on and probably already seen it before. So if you guys are new to this video and new to the devlog, this is what I made currently before I started recording. So let's go ahead and play. Alright, my fault, my fault. Alright, so as you can see, we are in the game and also I added this cool little um uh, build bar DIY thing. But that's not the point. You feel what I'm saying? So right over here is the right side. And let me show you how this works. So the bricks right here means one stud. So every stud, like the discounts, there's like a stud right here, there's a stud right there. So that is a stud. So we can click on this button, and then what it does is that you can choose where to walk. But there is a limit, but for right now, testing purposes is going to be around like 50. So let's go ahead and all you can do is just walk, right? And as you can see, it looks like I walk, but if I go to the chat, it doesn't say a single thing. So like someone in the chat said like people could get banned or get a warning for like chatting and stuff like that. So I found a way that looks like you're chatting, but you're also not. I figured out that issue. You feel what I'm saying? And also people were saying like to make a command saying to like walk and to like, like to put like walk, like how many meters you want to walk. Like I saw that and I was like, maybe I could do that, but another twist, you know? So I added this and let me know if this looks cool guys let me know if i should put this in the game no i'm just kidding i definitely am gonna put this in the game what am i talking about all right so ladies and gentlemen sorry i'm back so i'm in the original game right now this looks completely normal like the the other devlog but right over here you can see that this is the same button that i showed you before with the walk button right here so let me go ahead and play and show and let me see this is my first time actually like using the gui in this game so this is a first view impression i'm not like acting you know what i'm saying so we're in the game and okay it says walk to walk forward but i disabled the script so if i type walk i can't walk at all but if i use this and as you can see you can see how many studs you have because like i added this little part thing right here let me know this is cool you feel what i'm saying so uh, let me add like 20 studs so then you can walk right here and then you walk perfectly at 20 studs so then instead of like having to type left and right you can use shift lock and then it'll still work the same way like you can walk right over here and then you can walk exactly right there you know what i'm saying but the thing is is that i didn't add a jump button yet like literally i can just like walk like right over here into like the thing and then i can just instantly just die like that so i need to add a jump button like around right here but besides that like ladies and gentlemen this didn't really take me long to code but like i thought this was a good idea like i should definitely use this and i'm pretty sure you guys would enjoy this too so yeah that's pretty cool you know what i'm saying all right so i'm back after reading you guys's comments and someone in the chat said i should do like a leaderboard and i should make something easy hard and medium and hard mode so I feel like that's actually a really cool idea. And I feel like, cause like right now, this is literally just the whole game. So I feel like the whole game should have a huge lobby. And then there could be three doors, like easy, medium, and hard. And like with the same concept, but like it's I, I don't know it's it's a really cool idea so like thank you so much for the paragraph I, did, I didn't really I just told you guys to comment down below I didn't ask you guys to make a whole essay but, but I do appreciate it though I do appreciate I do appreciate you guys' comments you feel what I'm saying so 
let's go ahead and actually try to make a quick little lobby real quick all right so i'm in my testing world and guys if you guys don't know already i am not a builder i'm a literal scripter so this is gonna be so hard for me to actually build a map but i'm gonna try guys this is not an excuse it's not supposed to be an excuse so i'm actually gonna sit here and actually try this is a learning experience for me but this is probably like bruh to you guys so you know what i'm saying so let's go ahead and build a lobby all right, ladies and gentlemen, I am back, and this is what the map looks like so far. I had these cool little things. I, I'm not sure what this is going to be, but this is probably going to be, like, a leader stats or, like, s some leaderboard right here, and this is going to be, like, the update log, but, like, without the GUIs and stuff. And I added this cool little name tag and some uh, a spawn location right here, and I added some cool little terrain right here. I Sadly, I can't do Blender. I just can't. But, like, you already know I'm a scripter, not a builder, but this is the best I can do for now, but there could be some terrain over here here there could be obbies and stuff right here so this is progress so trust the process you feel what i'm saying so yeah let's go ahead and add some more things um i, I tried making a tree from like a google image i found like this one right here so like this is what i have so far i don't think it's bad or anything but i, I feel like i should add some leaves so let me go ahead and add that real quick let me make this green and let me put this to here there we go i want this tree to feel like i'm gonna use blocks for now because like blocks for now because like i want it to feel more like old roblox like where like it's just only built with blocks instead of like because like now today we have like blender and stuff like that so like, i want to use like the old stuff you know I, I like i like old stuff you feel me so let me go ahead and make these leaves I don't know how do they do that they make it look so elegant but mine is just oh wait the what are the leaves are like rotated a little bit so let me go ahead and control four put this here there boom and rotate this randomly so it's more crazy and solid like that because like it's a leaf you feel me i mean and not only a tree a tree that's what i meant i have sorry you guys can just tell that i haven't been outside that often so you know all right so this could be the tree oh my gosh this is horrible All right, guys, I'm back, and um, I did a little thing. So I meant to make this be like a little portal or something, but like this looks way more than just a portal. This looks like a globe or something like that. So like, oh my gosh, what is this? You know what I'm saying? So like, this looks actually really cool, and I'm pretty sure I'm definitely gonna keep this for the main game. So this is gonna be the teleporter. I'm there's gonna be a proximity prompt. You're gonna hold E to teleport to like you know the main lobby and stuff like that. So yeah, I just wanted to show this. This is absolutely really cool. So yeah, let's go ahead and make the lobby right over here. We just hit 200 subscribers in July. I was just about to get ready for school, but oh my gosh look at that thank you all so much you know what i'm saying but i gotta get ready for school so peace out you know what i'm saying all right ladies and gentlemen i am back ready to attack you feel what i'm saying so this is actually day three of me making this but pretend that it's day two but this is what the map looks like but i also made some cool little worlds just like what the comments said or what any of you guys said so if, if you guys said like to make an easy medium or hard mode or something like that then shout out to you you feel what i'm saying it's really hard to like you guys commented so much i couldn't even like keep up with how many comments you guys said so i, I you know if you put a comment down down or something like that i appreciate it you feel what i'm saying but these are going to be like the easy world so like each one could be um a an obby each one could be an obby right there and there could be like more obbies to, to go like you know and also if there's like if i can't fit any worlds left then there could be like a floor two or something so yeah that's good so we have the map done um i'm gonna do the obby later but some of you guys are commenting to say badges 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 make a welcome badge or something like that so i will make badges in a second <laughs> okay 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 fine fine i will make badges one second all right so the first thing i'm gonna do is the welcome badge so i have this little image right here which is a spiral you should probably see that like anywhere so i'm gonna put this here and this looks a little blurry i can see a little gray so i'm gonna go to adjustments go to brightness and put this contrast to like all the way up yeah there we go so now it's more 
yeah it now is more black and white so I'm gonna make this blue on every side let me add a photo let me add some glow yeah something like that okay perfect then let me add a vignette so what this does is that adds yeah it adds that okay wait actually wait let me make this like oh that is a perfect color okay that is perfect that is perfect okay so now let's go ahead and my idea was that there's gonna be a little chatterbox like something like this like that something like that yeah like either oh yeah so yeah this definitely okay so this will be the badge i'm not sure if this is the perfect size for it but who cares so we have that oh wait hold on wait someone's calling all right never mind guys it was a scam call all right but okay so here's this is what we're left off i think the roblox font is like doors or something like that so i'm gonna find i don't have the exact font so i'm not gonna waste time so i'm gonna uh find the right one like something like that all right so we have that done oh wait oh wait wait okay my fault okay my phone my phone i know i i misspelled the name i know i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry so we have that done right here okay Okay, I think that's good for now. So let me go ahead and copy this. Go to the badge thing, upload item. And okay, we're just gonna name this like welcome badge. Okay, then we can do you join the game for the first time. So this is what it has so far, you feel what I'm saying? So yeah, let's go ahead and actually work on the map right now. So we're in the map. There's gonna be like a bunch of worlds around the map. Like hopefully, hopefully soon. Hopefully soon if I have good ideas. So there's gonna be like levels to unlock and stuff. So like you can't just go to here and then you either like walk into here and then there could be like a white background that like just like fades in and fades out and then you teleport to the obby or something like that i don't know i want it to feel more polished you know this is what it looks like right now so let's go ahead and get to coding <sighs> all right ladies and gentlemen i am back after like an hour of developing um so the same lobby as usual but if i click enter I added this little black shadow and look it, it now you teleport to the lobby more professionally so once you walk into this door there you go you feel what i'm saying and then you know i can't move obviously but press this up arrow and then you can see how long you're gonna walk for so then if i walk right here then it says walk but if you go to the chat nothing it does not like you know you're not actually saying walk but like in the game it looks like it is so you're not gonna get banned for that so let's go ahead and walk so i'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate what this does so for right now keep walking you feel what i'm saying and if you touch on one of these things so wait hold on let me demonstrate so if you touch on one of these parts yeah you take a lot of damage i i think it's cool you feel what i'm saying so if you want to like um see how much you want to rotate then you can just use shift lock or you can use first person and you can just click walk and there you go so i quickly made obby 2 and for now i'm gonna leave obby 1 and obby 2 as like kill parts for now but obby 3 there's gonna be something let me know what obby 3 should be in the comment section sorry i cannot talk today but um yeah this is what uh this is so far so let me go ahead and test test all right so we're in the game i already did obby 1 so let's do obby 2 real quick and hopefully oh yes i could just do this and walk over here but i'm gonna let you guys finish this obby so let me know like what i should add to this you feel what i'm saying so